They need to know what the show's about. No, no, no. This, it'll go without saying. Oh, really? It'll go without saying. <laughs> All right. Start over. Start over. No, start no, over. No, 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 no. This is okay. it. This is it. This, okay. Okay. First, first product today, we've got a snacks theme. Crackers, cookies, chips. I don't know if we make chips. But we're starting with a cracker. And what this is, is... Joel, tell us what it is. Because Joel has not seen this. No, this I, is by the way, uh, every product you're about to see in this segment, I've not seen before. With so the exception of For the first time, I'm going to be trying these uh, and giving my giving you my honest to gosh review. This episode, so, yes. Right now, we're doing uh, wheat thins, uh, parmesan, and basil. I, I hope that's in the shot. Can you see that okay? All right, great, wonderful. Our, Tommy says yes. Our director is saying that we can see it. Tommy so, said, don't say my name on camera. Yeah, okay. All right. Parmesan, basil. Do you say parmesan? Parmesan. Parmesan. Wow, look at all the new flavors of wheat things they have. Wow, that's a lot. This, by the way, is where wheat things have gone awry, in my opinion. Because I've had some of the other flavors already. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten flavors of wheat things now on the market. Don't make fatty weight for the food, okay? <laughs> Didn't eat the whole box. Alright, so Parmesan basil is what we're trying. Okay, didn't make the bags any easier to open. Okay. Alright. Have a taste. I have not tasted these either. Okay, make sure the products stay forward there. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to try one. Yeah, this is exciting television. <laughs> no, uh... You know what it tastes like? Okay. <laughs> I'll spit on that guy. <laughs> Go ahead, you tell him. You tell him first. What do you think? It tastes like garlic bread to me. Yeah. Um, <laughs> do you agree? Yeah. It, it 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 would be good. It would be good with like a uh, like a spinach dip or something like that. It might be good. Yeah. Artichoke. I don't like it on its own. Um, it's too much. And this yeah, was my little... this was my original point. Wheat thins doesn't need anything more than just the wheat thin. They didn't need to start dusting it with all this ranch and tomato and yeah, it's like eating Doritos. I got it all over my fingers. Exactly. What I'm was eating. great about wheat thins is that the, there's so much flavor in the wheat thin itself. The original that um, I think they're ruining them by going all these flavors. So and it's all over my fingers. Yeah. I don't like that. Me too. I don't like that either. But it would be good with a dip, maybe at a party with your swanky. Yeah, or something that. different. Yeah. Something different. Yeah. Um, about it. If they can't afford the pita chips or something like that, yeah. you know, go crazy style. So, right. uh, so let's thumbs up, thumbs down, pass. Give it like, like a, uh, uh, depends on the situation. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. Thumbs. Yeah. yeah. If if they're out of the regular wheat thins, then get the parmesan. So, yeah. Okay. So you guys want to try some of these? No. Okay. Okay. So they're passing. Yeah, yeah. See, even our even our audience is passing on the wheat thins. All right. What do we have next, Jason? Oh, excuse me. I think that. We should just what? cut it right there. Really? <laughs> I think that was an episode. Was it? What do you think? We did ramble on a little long. Cut it. That's it.